All right, guys, we're back at the office. As you saw, we picked up a surprise pallet from Richie Brothers. So it's the next day, actually, and I was uh, waiting for you because I want to go through it together. So I paid 45 bucks for this pallet, which is pretty cool. All it said in the description was there is an inoperable snowblower and a boat motor. Uh, there was only a couple pictures, not too good, but uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm pretty pumped. I thought it was a good deal. I actually just bid on it and forgot about it. Uh, I thought someone was going to outbid me for sure, and I ended up winning it. So yeah, it's cool. It's going to be interesting. We're going to go through it right now, and uh, yeah, let's get to it. So here it is. And here you can see the snowblower. Here you can see the boat motor. The grease guns. So let's check it out. Let's see what's in it. Right, so what do we have? First thing we have toolbox. Empty. It's still a nice box though. What is this? I don't know how much it is new, but about 40, 40, 50 bucks. We gotta, we gotta cut that strap off. Hold on. Let's cut the strap off. I'm going to cut it off of this. Okay, so the, the key pile. Handy little toolbox, not bad. What is it, Stanley Fat Max? We got. Here it comes close. It's a brand new motor in a box full of water, of course, because there's outside. So that's kind of cool. Post support. This. Uh, this. A dovetail joiner, brand new in the box. Steering wheel cover, that's garbage. Got grease gun. Another grease gun. Another grease gun. Those always come in handy. Sprayer. Any sprayer. Oh, another sprayer. Let's break it. Oh, here we go. This auction. Everything was sitting outside. The flap disc for air. Another one air. What is it called? The hit. What that could be called. Oh, that's nice. Craftsman. So a hammer gun, or a, what is it, air hammer. Like, that's a shame everything got wet though, eh? Impact gun. Another impact gun. Hammer. Grinding discs. Hammer. It's a shame that everything was left out. Right, here we go. Another one. I'm going to have to clean these up. That's a nice one. That was small. Pieces for me. Like I said, all these things sit outside during the auction so everything gets wet. What's this? Air horn.
They look brand new. The box. The box is back. Old gas can. Cable. An old calculator. That's like a wide load flag or a marker flag. The car mats, garbage. Well, here is one thing. It's a uh, polisher. That aside, we'll plug those in all after, see if they work. Oh, another sprayer. This one looks a little bit nicer, actually. Well, it's got a little handle on it, or a strap. What the heck's in it, though? That's the question. Glass suction cups. I don't know, those are uh, never come in handy. Vacuum cleaner. One other thing we gotta check to see if it works. It's come in handy. But Old rope. It's probably garbage. It's this. Oh, that's for the sprayer. Sucks so far. The starter doesn't work. Of course, you always got to spill a little bit. I don't know why they they make these gas cans so bad. Jesus. Hilarious one pull. <laughs> That's so funny, man. 
Alright, let's see if this thing works. like the carburetor could use a bit of cleaning but other than that it's pretty funny here come check this in this thing here this shaft is spinning inside of this shaft so it looks like it's just missing a pin yeah it is so it's missing a pin here so that's a two second fix with a cotter pin and the chute will work so it does work, just a little bit bent, but that's, that's a super, super easy fix. So next we'll uh, we'll try the boat motor. I don't have uh, too high hopes for this thing, but we'll uh, get some mixed spray in it, throw some on the carb here, a couple squirts of some two-stroke uh, mix, and we'll use a drill. Like I said, the, uh, the pull starter is non-existent. So we'll try that, we'll see if we can just get her fired up real quick and we'll go from there. Okay guys, check this. We got a, a drill hooked up to it. Cause like I said, the pole starter is broken. I got some mixed gas in here. We're gonna squirt some down on the carb and see if we can get it to just fire. is not this working? There we go. Let's see, see what happens. Oh, she popped. Let's see, actually, you know what? This is a choke. Well, she got sparks. She popped a little bit. There we go. So funny. Old mo. I bet you this thing hasn't ran in years and years. What do you guys think? Oh, that's that's hilarious, man. Oh, actually, you know what? Stupid me. Let's put the throttle on start. I didn't do that. More fuel down there. She doesn't want to fire now. She don't start. Taking the plug out. Maybe we lost spark. Let's see. Oops. Hopefully, I'm getting fuel. I okay, said so maybe I just. Maybe there's too much. Maybe there's too much fuel. Let's see. 
Super getting spark. Oh yeah, we're getting great spark. Yeah, hell yeah. Plugs look pretty good. Ah, uh, maybe we'll mess with this thing. Be fun just to get it running, no? I don't know. Let me know down in the comments. But like I said, I was literally just gonna sell this thing. Whatever. If I get, uh, 200 bucks for it, 100 bucks, whatever, I'm getting my money back regardless. But, but, uh, yeah, maybe we'll actually fix it. And take the carb off, clean it, try that. Check it out. Next on the hit list is these three, three items. So we got a vacuum cleaner. Let's see if this sucker works. Let's see you guys can Old cheap vacuum cleaner. Let's see. That's a little shot that comes in handy. Okay, no. That is garbage. Next is the polisher. Let's see. Oh. There we go. That'll come in handy. This is this old uh, bench top. Grinder. Actually, someone put a polisher on one side and sandpaper on the other. Let's see. There we go, guys. Perfect. Works. So that comes in handy as well. Works. So, first, we're going to do these uh, little air tools. So that works. So, that's good. Look at all the water coming out of here. What happens at Richie Brothers when uh, we leave everything out in the rain? There you go. Works. Let's see, it's got the water coming out. Well, this one actually seems pretty powerful. The water's shooting out of it. It is what it is, guys. Guess I had 45 bucks. I can't complain. PB blast. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, anyways, this one should come back to life. Kills it. Let's see. 
She works. There you go. Okay, last but not least is this little guy. I think it's jamming up in here. Alright, so I was thinking guys, last but not least, let's try this sucker out. I was thinking, it doesn't matter if it's got a compressor with it. We got a compressor in the shop, so let's plug it in and see how loud this sucker is. Holy, that is loud. Wow. So loud, oh my god, that hurts my ears. Well, that's cool. Maybe we'll leave that project for another day. You can use it somewhere down the line. So that's it, guys. That's the pallet. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Like I said, in the comments down below, let me know. If you want to do a fix up of the boat motor, yes, no, or should I just sell it? Let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe, peace, and we'll see you in the next one.